in VR everything is fun in games until you have to beat debug. And with the Hurricane VR framework, the um, unfortunately the the well-known XR device simulator is not working. But luckily there is a um, an extension which can be downloaded. Um, I'm quickly going to show you how to set it up. So I've already downloaded it and then you add it to your Unity project and import it. And then you add a new game object. Hands and body simulator. And then you grab the the added scripts under Hurricane VR uh, framework. No, Hurricane VR extension simulator. And then you add uh, uh, you just drag those script in there. And yeah, you'll have this error in the in the console if you don't have the Hexabody VR framework. Then you can just ignore this, delete this, and um, let's see. Did we? Did uh, yeah? We already added this one, and we can add the control. And then here in the in the rig, we need to drag our um, uh, VR rig. I'm using the prefab here, and then everything is good, looking good, and you can start to try it out. And you will see that you still have the problem with the height, so this doesn't, it's like falling on the ground. And there's actually an explanation to this in the docs and in the floor offset. What we need to do is we need to activate in the camera rig the the keyword recalibrate uh, so you you enable this and you set a key that you want to re recalibrate recalibrate the the floor offset and then it's the key r and then you're here and then one other thing is the the um, hands yeah, I should have put this, usually I put them here. Yeah, we're not in safe mode. So I would put this in here, so it's a bit more organized. And then here in the VR hands, I put this to zero. Yeah, that's to zero. And then the hands should be right below the camera. I press R, boom. And then here on the left, if you enable this one, or disable it, it will um, it will render this here on the bottom left, which is very helpful to to know how to move around, how to move the mouse, and uh, yeah. So this is very helpful with with Q. You can move left hand with uh, E. You move right hand, and then scroll. You can move them back and forth. Um, then let's take this fire extinguisher for example. If I Go with the right hand. I can move it down. What's a bit uh, not so well done is that it moves out of the window. So be careful when you click other apps or move out on the second screen. And then so I have to hold Eve, and then you see what what I can do. I can do, for example, the grab here. Then I take it. I can hold E, middle mouse can rotate it. And then, for example, if I want to, yeah, this is especially helpful for 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 debugging. So, for example, if I want to go here, set the breakpoint, um, start the debugger, and then I think this this one. Boom, I can I can uh, debug my code and this is helpful especially if you if you're on Mac and you cannot control the hands directly in the unity editor 
or um, if you just want to quickly test something without building to the device. Yep, I think that's it. Um, let me know in the comments if you if this helped you out. Thanks for watching.